Stop showing off down there, shouted the monkey from the upstairs window. Hurry up and bring that small person up to us. The giraffe is waiting. I climbed into the big orange beak, and with a swoosh of wings, the pelican carried me back to his perch on the window sill. The giraffe looked out of her window at me and said, How do you do? What is your name? Billy, I told her. Well, Billy, she said, we need your help, and we need it fast. We must have some windows to clean. We spent every penny we had on buying this house, and we've got to earn some money very quickly. The Pelly is starving, the monkey is famished, and I am perishing with hunger. The Pelly needs fish, the monkey needs nuts, and I am even more difficult to feed. I am a geranius giraffe, and a geranius giraffe cannot eat anything except the pink and purple flowers of the tinkle tinkle tree, but those, as I am sure you know, are hard to find and expensive to buy. The pelican cried out, Right now I am so hungry I could eat a stale sardine. Has anyone seen a stale sardine or a bucket of rotten cod? I'd eat the lot upon the spot, I'm such a hungry bod. Every time the pelican spoke, the beak I was standing and jiggled madly up and down, and the more excited he got, the more it jiggled. The monkey said, Why, what Pelly's really crazy about is salmon. Yes, yes, cried the pel pelican. Salmon, oh, glorious salmon. I dream about it all day long, but I never get any. And I dream about walnuts, shouted the monkey. A walnut fresh from the tree is scrumptious, galumptious, so flavory, savory, so sweet to eat that it makes me all wobbly just thinking about it.